So hello, hello, welcome to Kenneth's World. My name is Kenneth, and welcome to today's mukbang. Today we are out here in Santa Ana on a bright, beautiful blue sky day. What we have for you on deck today is going to be Turkish food. We have here Turkish drink fries. I'll show this to you. Boom. Seasoned fries, veggies, jalapeno, their house sauce. And we got beef on top of that, so that's gonna be awesome. We have here their pita. We have here their pita chicken, house sauce, a bunch of veggies, that's gonna be exciting. Then for dessert, what we have here is baklava. But without further ado, let's dig in. So today is one of the sunny days um, instead of the rainy days that we've been getting. So we're going to go for the main dish here. This is pretty awesome. It's a widespread of almost every veggie that they have. Corn, pickled cabbage, um, some cucumbers on here. It's not cilantro, it's parsley. <laughs> cilantro is parsley. Those of you guys that are worried, there's some jalapenos. I should have got some more jalapenos. And then beef all on top of a bed of fries. Oh, there's some pickled onions. Look at this. Look at this bite. Mm. So the meat is done the traditional way and the stick is kind of like a pastor, but it's mm -hmm. not. <laughs> yep. They have three different kind of uh, meats, or falafel, um, chicken, or beef. So I got beef on one item. All these, the pickled veggies. Oh my god! Look at this. It's a perfect blend of different foods, how the onions, how the cabbage, everything works together. It's salivating while eating it. It's just heavy, light, refreshing all together. It's awesome. Mm. I don't know why they have small napkins like this. Mm. This looks like the um, type of street food that you would get when you go to like other cultures at night, street vendors, this is what you get. As far as my experience, I haven't had that happen here where we have street vendors selling food other than like if you go into the heart of LA, the outside of LA, like other than, I guess you could find it at a um, farmer's market, but it isn't the same as having like street food like this. This tastes amazing. Mm. The weather's been crazy, so going on a day like this is actually really nice. One of the few sunny days that we have here. Mm. Mm. 
This is how I envision um, like street food to be, where a combination of fresh flavors mixed all together. You got the beef, you got the fries, you got the thing. It's just so glistening, like different flavors, the colors. Like you eat with your eyes first of all, first and foremost. So this is like pleasant to the eye. Even if I'm already digging into half of it, it still looks amazing. Mm. Add more sauce to it. Mm. This is um, their house sauce. It's all uh, right there. The creme de la creme right here. Look at that. Look at the mountain of, of stuff in here. Open it up a little bit more for you guys. That's huge. That is huge. Some pita bread, a lot of veggies again. This is actually the chicken. softness of the pita bread, the sauce coating the flavor, the veggie inside, if you can see the veggies right there. Oh, so good. Mm. veggies mm. so good mm. this is completely new to me it would be new for you so this go out there explore different new places definitely try out the foods we're not sure how authentic it is <laughs> but I'm okay. this, this is a donner place i'll show you the picture of the place as mediterranean turkish. and turkish food so we got the baklava so baklava i know is a little bit more traditional but the pita and the veggies i'm not too sure but it all goes well together. It resembles street food. So comment below. Let me know what your street food is. Or what you are willing to try. Now between the fries and this. Let me know what you guys would do. What you guys would pick. The pita is such a great uh, vessel for this. It has the same combinations. But it's just you decide between fries or pita. Mm. 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 
Mm. Mm. Mm. Mm. Mm. Let's go with these right now. A baklava uh, I've had a long, long, long time ago. I honestly don't remember what it tastes like, but it looks very flaky. Looks like there's pistachio on it. I should have asked them what's on it, but I just wanted to try it with you guys. Looks like it's multiple, different layers of different things. Mmm. Mmm. Very sweet. Mmm. Oh, the layers all go well together. This will be really great with ice cream. Mmm. Okay. sell ice cream there too. <laughs> this will be a good combo with ice cream. This is that like right saltiness and um, textured. Really good. Mmm. Mm. It looks like the baklava comes in two different shapes. One is a sheet that they probably cut up, and this was one long row. Again, it looks like the same, there's a different way of doing it. So let's try it out. Mm. As I say in all my videos at this time, I appreciate you guys hanging out with me. I appreciate you guys staying tuned to this long this was a great food adventure i love this food i am definitely going to come back here if you haven't yet make sure you like subscribe comment below and let me know what your favorite street food is or which between the three you would try but into our next food adventure keep eating.